Strictly Come Dancing professional Johannes Redebe has shared the shock he felt after being approached by police officers following a performance on the BBC show's live tour. Johannes Redebe has recalled how he was once stopped by police who had claimed the Strictly Come Dancing star looked suspicious. The star, who rose to fame as a professional dancer on the BBC show, said he was approached by officers while outside one of the venues he had just performed at during the Strictly live tour. Johannes has reflected on the shocking incident in his memoir, Jojo, Finally Home. The Strictly favorite had shared his worries with his mom, whom he was on the phone to when the police van pulled up into the parking lot. He shared in his book in quotes obtained by the mirror. A police van pulled up into the parking lot where I was sitting. Two officers got out of the car. I said, Mummy, they are walking over to me. What did you do wrong? She asked. I felt stung. Nothing. I said, When they came over I showed my ID. Is there something wrong? I asked one of them. No, you look suspicious and like someone we are looking for. Maybe they were doing their job but the fact I'd just been on stage with thousands of people shouting my name and now I was being approached by police who thought I could be a criminal felt like a slap in the face. Johannes went on to reveal the moment, which he says occurred in Aberdeen in 2019. Had impacted his positivity from performing with his Strictly co-stars. Despite the incident, the South African dancer managed to regain his positive nature towards the end of the tour. Regardless, I wrapped up the tour oozing positive energy, he added. Dot. The dance champion first joined Strictly in 2018, winning plenty of fans through the BBC show. He went on to make history by partnering John Waite, as the duo became the first all-male partnership on Strictly. John and Johannes reached the final in 2021, but lost out on winning the Glitterball Trophy to Rose Ailing Ellis and Giovanni Pernis.